Hey there, welcome to even my YouTube channel. In this tutorial, I am going to show you how to create a product image slider in Shopify homepage without any app. So this tutorial will be very helpful if you're looking easy video guideline to create a product image slider in the homepage in your Shopify store. So let's get started. You can see that I'm in the homepage of this website and here is the featured product. This is the default option of any Shopify online store which built by Dawn theme. So basically there is no any image slider or gallery that would be more helpful eye catching and create more sales or create more engagement. So this is the main things that we wanted to do. So let me show you the real life result then you can understand better what we are going to do. You can see the result after do this feature looks here this is the same page in we are in the home page and here right now have a image slider looks very carefully it's working so it's more so this is the main things that i wanted to do today so i hope you understand now how we can do this basically i have already published the pull process on my website e-commerce thesis and i will share the website link or mainly this article links in the video description and here is the step by step process then you can follow easily but if i want to do this again then it should be hard for you and it will take more time better if you go to the my website or this page and follow step one by one so i want to share something about this article just go to the theme action and edit then layout open the theme liquid file so first of all you have to open the theme liquid file then find int of the head and paste this article this is the first things then you have to open main product liquid and find the below code this code you have to find it and replace this code with, with this code so this is step four I hope you can do this after following this article then you have to go to the step 5 find a schema and you have to do the same things just paste the below code above the start of the schema then go to the asset folder then you have to paste the CSS code then go to the global JS and you have to reflex few code following this article and here have every step one by one so i just wanted to make this article simple and share the main things with you that's why i am not going to do the full process like all of my previous video and you know that i always try to make simple easy video for my audience like you so i hope you understand and you will try it by following this step so thank you for your time to watch this video if you think this video is helpful then click on the like button and subscribe to my channel and if you need any help support relevant shopify wordpress or seo then you can contact with me have a nice day bye bye